On a spaceship in zero gravity, the Robinson family, parents John and Morin, along with their three kids, Judy, Penny, and Will, play a card game. There is mayhem inside the spacecraft when it collides with a planet. When John notices serious damage to a supply box, he scrambles to get the family off the ship. Will finds a way out through a frozen hatch, but the others are unable to escape. When the Robinsons discover their spaceship submerging in the ocean below, they are horrified. After evaluating their circumstances, Will remarks that the planet seems to be halfway between their home and the colony they were trying to reach. They are taken aback when Soldier on Deployment Morin reveals that he is standing outside the family. John affirms that they are not his soldiers as Judy evaluates Will's physical state. John cautions them that they won't have any supplies if the water freezes. Judy dives in to try to remove Morin's power cell, but the water freezes around her. Judy makes it through five hours, but Morin's damaged leg gets worse and she collapses. As John struggles to free Judy, Will recognizes that something is burning hot. Magnesium. In the vicinity of ice when he spots white flames in the distance. Worried that she won't be pleased that John won't be able to come home because of his soldier duty, Penny purchases a Christmas present for him. Since they haven't spent any time together, Penny makes an effort to get to know Will. Soldier Will Robinson believes he doesn't belong in the gang and holds himself responsible for Judy's circumstances. After falling down a lengthy, frigid tunnel, John, who has been emotionally repressed because of his army training, gives him comfort. Judy, who has medical and surgical training, walks Penny through a treatment that relieves her discomfort. When Will awakens at the end of the tunnel, he is faced by a frozen mountain and a forest. After speaking with John and John over the radio, he is instructed to return the magnesium in order to save Judy. In a flashback, Will and Judy are shown constructing a scale model of the Resolute, a massive spacecraft. Will chooses to look into it after realizing they are going to be on the actual thing. The other half is hooked on a tree branch while he flees after seeing a robotic being. Judy is set free when JN uses magnesium to melt the ice. When John gets to work, he finds out that Morin needs him to give him official custody of her children. Their marriage is having problems, and John is furious that she wants to take his children away from him. After realizing he is safe, Will releases the robot into the wilderness. After the robot is put back together and Judy is saved, the Robinsons depart in their separate landing ships. In this synopsis, an extraterrestrial robot that kills every passenger during a disturbance is encountered by the Robinson family. Dr. Zachary Smith's jacket is stolen by an untrustworthy woman, who then uses it to board his assigned Jupiter ship. The Jupiter ship takes off, but the Resolute is drawn in by a cosmic portal that opens. Zachary and Dawn are among the evacuation Jupiters who make it through the crash. The robot amazes Morin, who clarifies that it is artificial rather than biological. The Robinsons spend the entire day restoring the ship to flight condition. When Penny notices an explosion in the distance, they come to the conclusion that there may be other survivors. John is against Morin's decision to learn more about the robot. John gives Will an invitation to go on an adventure with them, leaving the girls to figure out how to get the ship out of the ocean. In the distance, Zachary and Don notice heat indicators and make the decision to approach them. They discover a woman who is, amazingly, still alive but not cognizant. A map that Morin and John discover shows they are not even in the Milky Way. When the robot stops interacting with the spacecraft and the power is cut off, Will discovers that it is obedient and nice. When the storm hits, Don and Zachary make the decision to seek shelter. The Robinsons sprint against the storm as they save the three survivors. Zachary becomes alarmed upon seeing the robot, but Will reassures her that he is not a threat. 